This is a video for the demo of a game called Shadow's Peak. And the first thing I'll mention is that it does have full screen exclusive mode. So you can change resolution here and it will uh, change your monitor into that resolution, which is great. You can also run it window down here if you want. As subtitle, you can enable V-Sync. And it's got a field of view, I haven't touched that yet. And the only thing I've done is put the music volume down a little bit. So, yeah, I don't know anything about this game. I'm just going to jump in. Give it a look and see what it's like. A lot of dark legends surround this place. That's why, by offering Michelle to meet here, I've decided to kill two birds with one stone spend some time with Michelle and gather some information from my book about myths and legends. The problem I have is that when I'm near Michelle, I completely forget about my work. Michelle! 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 Can't, can't see here. Um, ah, so we can only do controls. Um, oh, here we go. Mouse sensitivity. <laughs> that's lucky. Now, uh, that's a little bit better. to interact. Save. Okay, so it's a save point. Well, there's a lighthouse over there. I wonder if maybe I want to head over that way. From unknown. You can't hurt them, but they will try to hurt me. to my body.
keys to the cabin. <coughs> Sounds like you can hear some breathing, but I don't know if that's my breathing. What the hell is that? Didn't even see anything. And I guess I gotta use inventory. So how do I use my first aid then? Telling me it was a um, like an auto use me kit, so I picked it up and I only got about four health out of it. And now I need fifty. Yeah, does not sound very good, does it? And something attacked me, I don't know what it was, but something hit me when I was around here. But you can hear it, but where it's where is it? What is it? Maybe is there a snake in the grass? Well, I'd say we're in a bit of trouble now. Keep out. You got any first aid or anything? There's no door. <laughs> How do you get in? It's all blocked up, is it? But, um, what was that? Some kind of house? Well, don't you hate it when you're in a game and you? You got bugger all here. Yeah. Famous serial killer was seen in the vicinity of Shadow's Peak. Uh, okay. Bottle there, I don't know if you can pick that up. Like it, does it? Uh, I might have to change a um, key here. Let's have a look. Yeah. I'm going to change crouch to C. Can I replace with a C? Um, so I use map on Q. Headlamp on F. Well, I think Q for map's a bit weird. Uh, maybe I'll make map tab. Uh, what else? Between previous web and use a mouse. Zoom. F mouse button fire. Yep, everything else looked pretty good. Cool. Alright, uh, what now then? Well, where's the cabin? Well, there's some kind of a red light up there.
that a whale That's pretty cool, but what's it doing in shallow water? Looks like it's going back out to sea. You can't actually get right up the top there, can you? Head over this way. What the hell? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> what the hell? What the hell was that? It wasn't even walking, it was like bloody Hovering or floating or something. <laughs> uh, let's try again this way. Maybe we'll find something this way. Mouse. Switch between items. Yeah. Now you can see them. Now you can't hurt them, but they will try to hurt you. Wow, that thing kind of like touched you and you were dead. And it was moving pretty quick. I, I don't think you could outrun it. I mean, I'd give it a try, but... Uh, looks like something over here. Maybe this is a cabin. Oh, do I have the key on me? Yeah, I... Shelf car. And I came in on a bike apparently. <laughs> it's a pretty small looking bike. It's like a kid's bike or something. I mean look how small that tire is. That looks like that looks like a wheelbarrow wheel. So some of the scaling's a bit off. Why the key here? Oh, how annoying! Blood on the floor. Door is locked. Don't know what that noise was about. It looks like a face in the uh, spider web. Not dead. Oh, look, there's a phone. Good work, Michelle. Take that gun and continue. Hmm. So it's kind of like somebody is telling us what to do kind of thing all right so we got a knife i don't know who he's supposed to be Yeah, that's 
pretty weak looking, isn't it? Possibly a light down there. Well, what do I do? Do I go that way or should I try and get the key and then we'll come back and see what's in here? What is down there? Is there something down there? Oh look, there's a key. Oh man, we can get in the house. Missing people. <laughs> what the hell? Right behind me. Oh. Yeah, doesn't really. Uh, Kill me one off that time, but yeah, kind of weird how you can't use a door like shut a door. Even the fridge door, I can't shut. Another person disappeared. People are starting to believe in an old wood witch legend. Uh, save point. Yeah, it's it's kind of a bit weird. I mean, you can't do anything. I I, I don't know what you're supposed to do. I mean, it's I'm not going to go and get the other key now. But well, we got in there. So was that the cabin though? I don't know if that was the cabin. I guess it might have been the cabin. But then again... Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, it's, it's a tricky one. I'm just guessing really because I don't know, you see. Guess what I'm interpreting. Can you do anything on here? No. Yeah. So what do we do? This ain't telling me anything. What the heck is that? Is that a ship anchor? A bit like it could be. Can't walk into the water. It sounds like footprints. See if I can stab him. Eh? Yeah, pretty lame, you know. What's the point? I mean, it said that you can't hurt them, didn't it? 
You can't hit them, but they will try to hit me. So who's what? What's that? Is that a, a cop car? What is it? So what? What's this supposed to be? That? I mean, it doesn't look like a road, does it? I don't know what the hell that's supposed to be. And then it says two town, but I mean, you're not gonna. You know, get the town going, there's nowhere to go. Unless of course it's all collapsed in, but looks a bit weird, doesn't it? Ah oh, well, yeah. I don't know. I don't think you can outrun them. You can't hurt them. So then what would you need the weapons for? Because you, you, you know, I, I assume that you would get guns because you can aim. I mean, you can't aim with an eye. So... Yeah. Yeah, I don't have a headlamp. I don't know. So you can hear something. But you can't see anything. It's kind of... <laughs> it makes you think that it's uh, scripted events, you know. It's not dynamic, it's still scripted. Someone must be around. Yeah, there's something around. But where? No service, but I've got a new message. We need fresh souls. Kill them and you'll get your fiance back. Kill who? You know? It's it's annoying because the the footprints and the um the breathing and the talking and everything, it's you know, there's nothing there. It's just scripted. So you can't use it to get a direction of what where something is because there's nothing there. And then that black spirit or whatever it is is just going to pop up in a set location. See that there means something. I mean, well, that, that's one of the. Oh shit, that's two. <laughs> I mean, it's pathetic because you can't, you can't run and you can't do anything. You can't attack them or anything. So, what's the point? As long as you've got above fifty percent health, it won't kill you. James, where are you? So, is that Michelle? James, come out. It's not funny. Ah! 
Now, is it because I had the knife in my hand? <laughs> See, like there was talking, and it would make you think there was something around here, but there's not. So the car was up there, wasn't it? What? So I take it that person is uh, dead? <laughs> wasn't that hard was it just a couple more so what she drove into the tree here yeah I mean it's it's kind of like a walking simulator for the level of interaction, <laughs> I'll put it like that. So you just basically walk through a story. You see, look, every time you hear that, let's see if we can outrun them. I don't know, maybe I did. It's hard to say because I thought it said I had 90 house and now I've got 80. So I lost 10 house, but mm, I don't know. This doesn't make much uh, sense. But yeah, I need a a game that's kind of more interactive, you know. No, no, I'm going. to read what that said. Wow. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know. Um, it's, it's, a, it's basically a walking sim, but it's horror-based. Um, yeah. I don't know, it's just very scripted, and 
Uh, there are jump scares. Um, they do try to make a scary atmosphere, but it's, uh, you know, it's, it's all just scripted. Like, I mean, it's, there's nothing there. It's, um, so I, I think it's the voices and the breathing and the uh, footsteps, they all play after a certain um, certain amount of random time or, um, you know, like it was, it was like a certain amount of time, I should say, not a not, uh, random amount of time. Um, because the, the time window between when we heard them, it just, it seemed like a pattern. Um, but yeah, there was nothing, um, oh, okay, uh, yeah, we just said some loud thunder, but, uh, I thought it might have been in the game for a moment, I had to take my headphones off to check. Um, but... Yeah, um, you know, that's, yeah, it's, it's, it's not really my, my kind of thing. You know, I'm more into a game that's a bit more interactive. Um, you know, like things are, a dynamic, they happen based on what you do. Uh, so basically, if you sneak around, keep out of view, um, you know, then you're not going to be spotted, are you? You know, whereas in this game, it, it wouldn't make any difference because, um, you know, everything is all scripted. As soon as you walk over a, a line, or step into a certain area, then, you know, this is going to happen no matter what, you know, no matter whether you're seen or heard or whatever, it doesn't make any difference. So, yeah, uh, that's what it's like. You can try it for yourself. Uh, there's a demo on the Steam store page. And um, see if it's something you like. Um, So thanks for watching and we'll catch you in the next video.